Right, as usual, has arrived. Lee's been adventurous and got the same thing. It's, it's got all our safe. It says lodge it. guy. So she's crocheted it. Life at the lodge. This one now is the like, the piece de resistance. Yeah, that looks Check good. this out. Oh wow. my God. Good morning, good morning. We had an unexpected lion because I told Alexa to stop instead of snooze this morning. So I, I didn't heard it and giggled because I knew that what you'd done. I heard you say it. Uh, you, I know thought, what yes, I, you know what? Yes, she's not going to pest me in eight minutes you and know, then we'll walk up an hour later. You know what I giggle at? Your weight? Those Christmas cracker... Um, your weight loss? Your weight gain, I mean? Gigs that you have on in your I don't care. Go on, don't, nice. don't come off oh, the subject. On, There's a bit of a blueberry stalk there. Don't. Uh, Come on, coffee cup love for me. I'll, I keep saying it until you acknowledge me. What subject? Oh yeah, well we've had our you put on? frigate week. That's what I'm gonna say, so I don't have to be pit. Um, and I put three pound on since last week, so um, that's my frigate week over and done with tonight. Because I've got to um, chair our fat fighters meet tonight. Well, that's a bit of a hypocritical. And I've got to, to share it. myself. Ah. I've got to call myself a fatty. Uh, yeah, but there's a lot of fatties this week. Yeah, a lot of people put on. It's your fault they've been taking our advice. No way. I'm not telling to buy a cheese board. Don't forget my ca smart cafe. One cup. I want coffee. I'm not told them to buy a cheese board and pick out like greedy pigs. So, we mentioned in yesterday's vlog, if you saw that, that we hopefully, fingers crossed, have something coming today, Disney related, that I think you guys would really like to see. Um, it's for our apartment, um, somebody has sent us it, um, somebody who we know already, and um, we'll show you that soon. I've got to edit now because it's going up to 10 o'clock and I've not even edited. That's what I don't like about getting up late. Hurry up with my breakfast, please. I've my eyes off, but my eyes, I've got really bad hay fever and my eyes are all red and, and oozy. Are you ready? I'm waiting for you. Are you ready? Are you ready? I'm waiting for you. Right, we're going to go out for coffee. No, um, stop. We're gonna go meet our friends uh, on their way. We haven't seen them since Bulma. No, we went to Bulma with them in Animal Kingdom, Sandra and Steve, and had a lovely meal there. And obviously, um, because of all this coronavirus, we haven't seen them since then. Um, so we're looking forward to seeing them, having a coffee, um, and getting our Disney goodies from them. Was that January when we saw them? Yeah. yeah Seems like nice. another lifetime ago, doesn't Seems it? Seems like previous holiday. Get your shoes on then. Come on. Right, so our original plans was to go to um, a reasonably close shopping outlet. We got there, um, Sandra and Steve haven't turned up yet. We got there, it was absolutely rammed. More busy than we've ever seen it even at Christmas. Staycation. So um, we're gonna have to go, unfortunately, back to the garden center to see the Russian. Um, Do we need more chippings? No, we don't need any more chippings, but we're just going for a toast to current tea cake. So they've turned around, and we're now heading across country to get there, and we're gonna arrive between two minutes of each other. So hopefully it's not gonna be busy there, otherwise we'll be eating sat out in the car park. And they're bringing their little doggy, I don't know what kind of dog it is. Well, they said it's a hypoallergenic dog. Yes, yeah, so I think it should be all right. Well, no, I think it's not, because I'm not allergic to dog fur, I'm allergic to the saliva. So, unfortunately, dogs oh, still lick. Just don't let it lick you. Right, as usual, has arrived. Lee's been adventurous and got the same thing. Yeah, I just fancy one too. And uh, Sandy and Steve are here. Sandra. Sandra and Steve. I always get them oh, wrong I'm now. Very difficult Too many of us. I know. <laughs> so, uh, and they brought the little pooch. Hello, hello. And they brought us Disney, Disney things. They've got some things in the car, which we'll show you later when in the vlog. Assuming we don't forget them, and then um, Sandra accidentally forgets to tell us and keeps them. <laughs> puts them on her own wall. And puts them on her own wall. <laughs> oh, you've just I've given just some away. Them away. So ke check out the rest of the, this vlog to find out what we've got. Mm. Right, nice little uh, toasted and current tea cake there, and a, and a, a green tea. Um, so now we're heading to a beach, because uh, the guys want to go to a beach and take the dog for a little swim. Um, and then we'll get this Disney stuff out, so I'll be later in this vlog and I'll uh, unveil um, what, we've, what we've been given. And we've been eaten by Thunderbugs, yeah, they're all like okay. millions of Thunderbugs. Hopefully when we get closer to the coast, um, the wind will not let them settle, but right now they're absolutely covering everywhere. We start scratching all the way back, aren't we? It's hot today though, it's 21 degrees. I'm going to change back into my shorts when I get home. Down at the beach, not much not much of a beach left. Well, you read the tide four. times, not me. Half past four, it's only half two. Well, there's a little bit of a beach, we can have a little mooch. I suppose two hours from now it's got to, it's got to go up that, that high bit, so oh. probably about right. Are you off for a paddle? No. Hmm. Right, we're back in the lodge and our friends Sandra and Steve have uh, gone home. Uh, as I said earlier, they kindly brought over a couple of things that we had sent to their address because they were large and they couldn't go to 
where we pick things up from. So, the first one is from one of our lovely lodgers, uh, Kelly. Uh, we have been talking to Kelly for a while. Um, before our PO box closed, she started making this for us. So I said, after lockdown had finished, we would get a, a, an address. So you we could find a way it. of getting it to us, which we have done. Which we have and done. I've got to say, this thing weighs an absolute ton. So Kelly has been making this, <clears throat> I presume, for months for us. Oh, there's a letter on it. Is there? Yeah, there's something inside too. What's on a car? Well, that's just a. Oh, God. You oh, open it, look. Let me open that while you open that. Go on. So, a card. Oh, there we go. Look, it's the. Uh, oh, it's, it's us. It's, it's our uh, logo right. from the. So it says. To Lee and Nick, thank you very much for all your vlogs and helping me through a very tough time. You may have heard this all before, but I'm very grateful to you both for help, help making me smile and laugh while I was going through what I've been going through. Uh, the bad days I'd spend in bed, binge watching your channel, help me through it. This is just a token of appreciation for you both for sharing your lives with us. Um, good days, it kept me busy making it for you. We love you guys, thank you. Take care and stay safe. Love from Kelly and Anthony. So thank you very much, guys. This is very much appreciated. We have seen a photo of this, but this is the first time we've seen it in real life. It matches the lodge. The picture looks slightly oh, cream. Gray. I thought it was cream on the photo. So we've seen this on photos only, but yeah. we, like we slightly said, we have no way of getting it to us when the PO box shut. So we've got something else open as well. That's the Disney thing that's coming next. Right. I cannot believe how, how heavy this weighs. Right, hold on. Mm. Cold. We've been sat on the decking with Sandra and Steve having a drink and it's really cold. So this is going to be coming useful for tonight. Right. Wow. <sighs> My god, it weighs an absolute ton. Which is the right way? I don't know. That's it. That's the way. Oh, up there. Like that. Oh, there we go. Oh my god, that must have took. Well, it's it's so... It's not like a bit. I can't even read it. It's, it's got all our say. It says the Lodge it. Guy. So she's crocheted it. Life at the Lodge. Uh, bimble, uh, laugh, stand back a bit, you're too close, I can't read it, <laughs> lodger, I'm like, it's massive, that will be perfect, for maybe as like a weighted blanket on the bed, uh, on the bed, on the bed in the apartment, well here, never mind the apartment, or even basically as a snow blanket on the, uh, yeah. on the sofa, so the world, oh, I, drink, I drank the world. Thank you very much, Kelly, for that. Yep, thank you. And I'll, I'll Leo be wrapping himself up with that tonight. <laughs> right, the second thing is from Les, who, if you saw a vlog a long time ago, sent us a big drawing of us, of myself. Some and pencil Nick. illustrations of us. Yeah, he did it in pencil, and he got in touch again before lockdown and said, uh, sorry, before our uh, PO box um, ended. It's open, it's open. Come here. I said, can I send you something again? I said, you, I said, you don't have to, but if you want to send us something, you can. So he sent us this. In fact, I've got a letter first. So we have seen pictures of this and we couldn't believe it. And we've been looking forward to seeing them in real life. This was, this, this was like shocking. So, that's the right way. Oh. There's, there's a big letter here, so I'll read it a, a little bit out. Um, Dear Lee and Nick, I noticed your interest in the Steamboat Willie and the Fantasia paintings when you were on holiday at Disney. So this I've, was in Epcot, wasn't I've it? I've attempted to paint them both. I will read the rest of that off right. camera. This is not an attempt. Of these. This is Epcot, Festival of the Farts. Uh, Festival of the Farts. <laughs> Festival of, Festival the, of the Arts. Oh, oh, right, it. so this is this one. You do that one. Oh, Let me open this one. Oh, this one's wrapped. Hold on. You do that one, let me do this so one. I asked Sandra to open them and send photos. So this is the first one, which is Steamboat Willie. It's called Steamboat Willie, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Which obviously is perfect colours for the apartment. Yep. Yeah. And then... So this is the... This one now is the like, the piece de resistance. Yeah. That looks Check cool. this out. Oh wow. my god. That is a bit closer. I don't know. I, well, I just don't know where we're going to put it, but we're going to have to find a place for it. So it's like the Sorcerer's Apprentice. But maybe. But, oh but my God, look, that is. Look. Amazing. Well, they're both amazing. I know that is something you would see if you were walking around Epcot and you and you're in Festival of the Arts. So there'd be a few hundred dollars for these. Easily. Oh my God, yeah. So we're not sure where that one's going, but it's going to go somewhere. Yeah, I think we'll put it in the hall, in the apartment. Yeah, Because we don't, we don't really yeah. have anything planned for the hall, this do we? This one can go anywhere in the apartment because it matches the colours that we're going to do. So, thank you so much, Les, for that. And I'll read the um, the letter off, off camera. Let me have a look at that I can't one. believe that one. That's just absolutely just, stunning. I mean, I like that one because it matches the colours, but that, the colours, everything about it is just... Mickey, the Sorcerer's Apprentice Mickey is my favourite uh, Mickey. 
So I absolutely love that. Now we've said to Les he should be doing this for a living. I think yeah, he just does he it as a hobby. He does it as a hobby. Uh, we asked Les if he wanted we, if he wanted us to share like his website or anything like that, but he doesn't do it. He just does it as a hobby, uh, which is fantastic. It does look good there. Maybe. Just trying on the wall there. Does look good. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I really want it for the apartment just because. But uh, it did look good then, though. It's like. It's almost like it's printed, even though he has done it by hand. It's yeah. almost like it's printed. Absolutely amazing, amazing. So thank you for that, guys. Yeah. We really do appreciate that. Right, it is now time for food. So in here we have onions, garlic, pepper. I'm making a meatball sauce. Yeah, Nick is making a meatball sauce with meatball sauce. A meatball sauce. <laughs> That's just as the base. Uh, so we got this from Lil yesterday, tomato and basil for meatballs. I'm more like some tomatoes all that. We have I'm some. Spicing one up myself. We have some spaghetti about to go in there. These are going to burn. I'll just I'll just mix them up for you. Um, and then we're having meatballs in sauce with pasta, and Nick has got some um, parmesan cheese to put on. What's this? Sugar plate. Oh god, that somewhat was strong then. It went right out my nostrils. I can't find it. Where's my basil gone? Well, why do you basil? Is basil in that? Because I want to have. If I had fresh basil, I'd, I'd spice it with fresh basil. We need a herb garden. So I'm going to grow a herb garden. I've just decided. Okay, I like that idea. When Sandra and Steve came, they brought us this. Um, I think Sandra's been getting them, and she she just thought we'd really like it. Um, so it's simply cook. You get four. Um, spice boxes. You don't get any ingredients, you just get no. spices. No, so let's have a quick look. Right, okay, so there's three spices in each one, and it comes with um, a recipe card for each one, and then you've just got to go out and buy um, the ingredients for it. So we're going to try one tomorrow night with some chicken. Which one did you say you wanted to try? Well, oh, that one. one. Because we've got everything in. We've got everything in. Not that one then. Cajun chicken with red pepper and sweet mashed potatoes. Yes, that's it. That we've one. got everything in that we can make that. Apart so from the. Um, now I am just going to now do some parmesan shavings to make the bulk of this sauce. If you can stir that for me while it's cooking. Of course I can. I'm an expert stirrer. I know that. Are we almost ready? Right, the meatballs, the uh, muscle food meatballs are done. Yeah. My pasta sauce, I've put a little bit of pesto in it because I didn't have any basil, so it's enhanced it with pesto. I've put all the usual ingredients in. Look at my nice little mat. Um, They'll be cleaned afterwards, obviously. So, uh, let me just stir this, this is, up. Is this all for tonight? Or this we'll... is split across two meals. Yeah. So the, the spaghetti is just for tonight, but this will last across two meals. And then we're going to grate some parmesan on, a little bit of garnish, and then we're ready to eat. Mm -hmm. If you'd like to get me some pasta dishes, please. Okay. Dinner served. Time to eat. You just had to put a little bit of coriander on mine, don't you? Coriander? No, I've never heard of coriander. Yes, well, stop it. So, eat your, eat your pasta. Yeah, thank you. Cooked by your delicious husband for your delicious pasta with your delicious red wine. Right, what's the verdict from thy uh, famous Lodge Guys meatball sauce? Beautiful. What about the um, Muscle Foods meatballs? Meatballs are absolutely out of this world. Do they taste like yes, we've been IKEA ones? Yes, been, we've been gifted it. But we always tell people that... We won't things. bullshit. We always reply and say, yes, you can send us it. But if it's crap, we will say it's crap. If it's good, we'll say it's good. Mmm, they are nice. They're right, absolutely beautiful. The They're like IKEA meatballs. The meat and the veg has been absolutely top quality from Muscle Foods, really impressed with it. Mm, it's almost, it's almost like steak rather than mince. Yeah. yeah, it is actually. Oh my god, but I do like my own meatball sauce, don't you think? This is what it looks like. Especially chef. Yeah, my chef. It's absolutely delicious. I will, at some point, write the recipe down, but I've kind of thrown it together with a bit of this and a bit of that. The only thing I don't like about it is the uh, coriander. The coriander's for garnish. Mm. The first bite of every meal with your mind. I've got to say that that was absolutely amazing, if I do say so myself. It's definitely not normal mince. That is definitely like a mince steak, like we had last night's dinner. But the um, the meatball sauce had a special ingredient, a secret ingredient. Pesto. No. Wine. Oh. It had like 100 ml of red wine. That's what darkened the sauce. And I put tons and tons of parmesan in there as well. What happened to you not drinking alcohol? Uh, you gotta have it with pasta. You could have had red wine. Is there any more seconds? No. That's tomorrow night's dinner. You can't have it. Oh. Right, it's time for our Fat Fighters group. Nikki is hosting tonight. Uh, so we're gonna join. 
and uh, explain how how we've, we've been fat and put weight on. I what? think I pissed on meatballs. I don't think it's meatballs, I think it's that red wine. I don't think I'm sick. Right, let's get on chatting with our fat fighters. Peace. Right, that's as fat fighters over with. So um, now that it's over with, I'm gonna have- Plenty of fatties this week, that's all I can say. Yeah, yeah, we've all had all kind of blowouts. Um, a nice cup of tea and, but, oh, I need more milk. I need a pint of that milk, don't we? Uh, oh, there we go. You want to share half a half a chunky finger? No, thank you. I'm dieting. So you don't want half of this? I'll have a piece off the yeah, end. Yeah, right. Just a piece off the end. I don't want the whole thing. Hello, guys. We fell asleep last night after the last scene. Don't pretend to be asleep. I can tell. <sighs> Nick went to bed as soon as we dad had Kit Kat chunky. Oh, I'm still tired now, actually. So. Uh. Is it nice weather? Let's have a look. Yes, I can see the well, I can see sun through the skylight, but I can't see any blue sky. Well, there's blue sky over there. <coughs> so, uh, I'd like you to finish the vlog now, and then get up and make some breakfast while I finish it. I'm still coming round. Click the subscribe button, click the notification bell, comment below, we read all comments, see you tomorrow's vlog, and um, Thank you for watching guys, bye. we really appreciate it. We really love what, reading your comments. Uh, get the camera off me, put it on yourself. And um, we'll see you tomorrow for a new vlog where hopefully we'll hear more about the, the thing. thing.